What's going on, people? It was just, I don't know what that was. But anyway, vlog was bona fide again, man. And, uh, <laughs> it's a, it, it, people are weird. People are weird as fuck. To the fact that there is, <laughs> they're at like your shit is their shit. Or they get mad at you when you take your stuff out of their reach for them to fuck with. It. Okay, I'm explaining myself. Okay, this is the thing. Okay. Where I live, right, it's like a dude place. Okay. You know. And my next door neighbor, their door is probably maybe 30 feet, maybe 20, 20 to 30 feet down, right? Okay, you got fucking, like, you got furniture out on the porch or whatever. You know, they have a little bit, and there's more on, my, more on our side. So, but anyway, it always had been a thing, whatever, because they haven't lived that long, man. That's a fucking young girl, man. And she always smoking weed and shit. And she always having these young niggas over there, you know, whatever, smoking weed. And she got a fucking child, right? Okay, so let defects, whatever, get involved in that shit. They're going to take the child away. But, anyway... So, every now and then, whatever, they come and take our chairs, whatever, and put them on their side, and don't put the motherfuckers back. Well, I ain't, she don't ask, if the company doesn't ask, they don't ask to use the chair. You know, they do it on the slick tip or whatever. So, this like been going on since she's been over there. She's been over there maybe like a couple months, maybe. Yeah, probably, yeah about a couple months. It hadn't, been, it hadn't been no more than three months. It's been less than three months, I know that. So, anyway. Me and my girl over there, we went out of town on the Labor Day weekend. You know, we was gone for like three days. Yeah, we was gone for three days. Well, we came back Monday, right? So when we come back and sit, and I didn't pay no attention or whatever. And my girl was like, she was doing, she like, she went over there, she said something. And I'm like, what is she doing? I'm still sitting in the truck. She said something. And I look up there and I finally see what she was talking about. I'm like, what the fuck? Okay, these motherfuckers, right? Three of, three of the dog Lauren chills or whatever that's on our side. Okay, these motherfuckers, they don't took the chill down on the other side, right? Took the fucking chill down on the other side. Her company, because they know we were gone for the weekend. Like I said, didn't ask. Don't never ask. Even if we were here, they still want to ask. Because that's how stupid she is and how her company is. That's why you can't really fool with niggas, man. And I mean, niggas in the sense of the niggas that, that, that ain't got shit, don't, ain't trying to have shit, or whatever, always trying to take shit, and always trying to use your shit. That's what I mean as far as niggas like that. But, okay, so my girl, she, she, you know what I'm saying, she get the fucking chills, and she bring those three chills, and then the other, the other um, furniture out there is like a little old-time little, like, like metal type of furniture, like a little bench, and like another, like, chair, it's like, like metal whatever can't bring them in the house but you know we move them bitches all the way down on our side so whatever because i'm like this shit this shit bullshit man you you just don't go and fucking take nothing off of nobody's fucking porch without asking you ask you give up the option to tell you yeah you can no you can't you don't just come take shit off the porch man that's why I let these young motherfuckers, man, I don't, I don't want the young motherfuckers living over here. They got no fucking respect. They got no respect for themselves. They got no respect for others. I hate that bullshit, you know. I wish they fucking moved, man. I wish she moved, you know. We ain't with, man, we ain't with that bullshit, man. But anyway, so after we did it, okay, this motherfucker, I, she ain't saying shit, though. She can't say shit because it's our stuff. But, you know, she, she only want to speak to a girl, my girl now, whatever, when she come up, you know, looking all fucked up, funk and shit, because we brought our shit inside, you know. How the fuck can you get mad about us bringing our own shit, or protecting our own shit, bringing our own shit in the house, and moving our shit down so you can't fuck with it? That's your company. The fucking chairs, you can get them chairs from there, Family Dollar, Dollar General, uh, roses or any other store like that, they don't cost much. Five, seven dollars, whatever per chair, who knows? 
You know what the fuck I'm talking about. Those plastic chairs, man. Don't call shit. If you got company over there, you go get you some motherfucking furniture, whatever chairs, whatever. You don't go fuck nobody and shit, especially when you don't ask nobody. That shit that pissed me off. You know, leave other folks shit alone. If you want to use something or ask for something, do the neighborly thing and go ask your neighbor, hey, I got such stuff going on, you know, can I use one of the chairs or whatever? And give us an option to say, well, okay, you can. Okay, no, you can't. And we say, no, you can't. You have to live with it. Deal with it. That's our shit. We don't want to sit in it. Don't sit in it. You know, that's the whole thing, you know. But, you know, that's why I say, don't, don't fuck with people's shit, man. I hate that, you know. And I also had some young folks over here before, a few years ago, you know. All right, they were breaking in my damn truck and shit, man. You know, it ain't shit in my truck, right? I ain't shit in my truck. Okay, I got rims on it, but, you know, I ain't got no, uh, I don't have no, no system or whatever, you know. Not no, you know, system, you know, with the speakers and shit. I ain't got none of that right there. Whatever, you know, matter of fact, my broke truck, the truck already had rims on it, so it's not something that I just, when I just try to set my vehicle up, well, you know. But anyway, you know, they, they, they were about to break it in my truck. They fucked up some shit in my truck that still haven't got fixed yet. You know, which I got to come out my pocket with. You know, they don't know, no longer live over here, but still, you know, that's the point of it, man. You know, a lot of black folk make the rest of us black people look bad because of the way they act, the, 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 the way they talk, the way they do things, man. You, you can't. How the fuck we supposed to get somewhere as a people, man? If you want to still. Do stupid stuff and act like somebody owes you something. Nobody owes you shit. But anyway, this is my thing, man, about my stupid ass neighbors, man. You know, they mad as fuck because we brought our shit in the house. So they can't fuck with it. We got money to go buy weed every day or whatever this that. Go fucking take some money to get you some furniture. So, anyway. Yeah, there's gonna be a point where I call the police whatever when I'm smoking weed all the time. We don't wanna smell that shit. I don't wanna smell that shit. I mean it's fine every now and then, every blue moon, whatever you wanna do it, go ahead. You know, but respect your neighbors when you're that close and the shit comes through the vents. Respect your neighbors. Shit, respect yourself because you got a little baby over there. You ain't supposed to be smoking around the fucking baby anyway. Young young motherfuckers, man. That's it's, it's just stupid. Anyway, vlogging bonafide, man. That was just my little thing on there.